display any form element value in the front end with the body forms hook field extension. I'm Sven from Seamcraft. In this video, I want to talk about how to display any kind of content and form element values of any form element easily with the hook fields extensions in the thingle view of your posts and any custom post type. Just install the body forms hook field extension and you will get a new tab in your form elements called hooks and it gives you new options to define where to display your value. Let's check it out. First of all, none, then before the title or after the title of your post, before the main content or after the main content of your post. For this example, I have already added two new form elements to our books example, which we use in many videos already. And I have selected after the content and I added a text field and a drop down. So we have some different form elements to show you how it works. And also in the drop down, I will select after the content. And now if I update this form and we quickly create a book, this is our first book with some nice content about a book. Now we have the two fields, one normal text field and here we can select three options and we select B. And now we submit this, we get redirected successfully to our post list. And now let's view this in the front end. And as we can see with some nice content about the book, normal text field under the content and B also under the content. Now, if we change this and we say the drop down, we want before the content and we want to display the label. This is this part here, drop down label. And we update this form again and we with the, the post, we can find drop down label, the value, the content, and then after the content, the text field. But we also have a different way on how to display these form elements. Sometimes you just want to have a nice table to display all the form elements, of course, except the title and the content, which is managed by WordPress posts or your custom post types. For this, we have a post meta box. In this meta box, there's an option which you can select to add the form elements as table under your posts. If we do so and we update this form and we refresh the single view of our post, we can see that we got a new nice table with our labels and the values created for us. So with this technique, we have at least a basic solution to display form element values before or after the title, before or after the content, or as a nice table after the content. We can go even one step further by using templates, and I will create a separate video for it. It's also possible to use it with Elementor so that you create a template in Elementor. We will also create another video for that. We hope this video was helpful. Let us know if you have any topic you like to create as a video or documentation. Thanks for watching.